All right, Publix is back on the channel. This is the uh, turkey cranberry sub. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I could be very persuasive. Uh, but Publix is now returning to the channel. Uh, I got a, a subscriber put a comment in my last Arby's review and said, hey, you gotta try the uh, Publix Turkey Cranberry Sub. So we have it here, uh, $8.19 for this freshly made bad boy right here. Let's check it out. All right, check it out right there. This is the whole sub uh, from Publix grocery store. Now Publix is huge in Florida. It is like a religion in Florida and uh, most of the South, uh, but whoa, look at that. The cranberry orange jam is doing a number on that uh, bun. So before this gets too crazy and the cranberry orange jam does a complete uh, sandwich takeover, let's check this out. All right, check it out right there. This comes on the five grain freshly baked bread right there and check it out. Yes, that is turkey, a Gruyere cheese. And I did get this um, toasted, so this is warm. And then you can see the cranberry orange jam just kind of took over right there. And I did get light mayonnaise on this, but I basically got this the way it comes. I didn't add anything else to this. The only thing I think I would really enjoy on this, even though I haven't taken a bite yet, would be stuffing. You throw stuffing onto this, and I actually looked around in the deli. I didn't see any stuffing, or I would have had them add this, uh, at least on one side. Uh, but yeah, that's only one half right there of freshly baked bread. If you've watched my channel enough, you know I am a huge fan of Publix and their subs, uh, what they give you in quality, size, and um, price. Uh, this one was a little more pricey, I'm not going to lie. And this is basically just the turkey, the cheese, that jam, and like I said, I threw some mayonnaise into the mix. So uh, without further ado, let's get into this. This is the Holiday, I believe. I think Holiday is in the name. I'll have to double check that. But this is the uh, Holiday uh, Turkey Cranberry sub from uh, Publix. Let's go. But here we go. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. All right, so first things first, the flavor on this, incredible. I mean, you have to like cranberry sauce uh, in order to probably really get the full uh, gist of all the flavors going on here. And I do love the fact that this is a orange cranberry jam, but I did forget to mention there is bacon. You can see a slice of bacon right there in the middle, um, but the bacon uh, was kind of non-existent and it is a floppy bacon. Uh, so yeah, I remember seeing her put that on and it just totally uh, glossed over uh, when I was giving you the description but this bun is so soft this freshly baked bun and then you have the uh, five grains on there that is a perfect uh, vessel to be housing this holiday uh, turkey sub but um, let's take a second bite I love that flavor I love the uh, mixture of the turkey with that Gruyere am I pronouncing that right Gruyere cheese uh, nice little change up she asked me do you want to put a different type of cheese on I said no I'll do it the way it comes. Thank you for asking, though. I appreciate it. Happy holidays. A little early, and no, I didn't say all that. All right, so I'm just going to keep this real. I do enjoy public subs. I love public subs. Uh, this one, to me, is just okay. I think if you added uh, a little bit less of the jam, I think it kind of uh, took over the flavor of this, even though I enjoy it, but you have to have a stuffing in this sandwich. And if you're wondering where that piece of bacon went, it escaped Shawshank. It jumped right out of the sandwich. I wish I had a camera on it because it literally just got up to the top of the uh, sandwich, did like a nosedive, hit the ground, and kind of crawled under the fence. Ghost. Swayze. It's out of here. So um, I'm going to take another bite. I enjoy this. Uh, one other little critique. I was hoping for like um, carved turkey. I was hoping for something different than their regular uh, turkey right there. But I do believe this is boar's head turkey. So it does have a nice flavor. And like I said, the Gruyere cheese is nice. And I just think she went a little heavy handed on that jam. But overall, this is a really good sandwich. And it has the potential to be a really great sandwich. 
sandwich. So final bite, we'll give it a rating, but uh, Publix back on the channel. And if I find the uh, comment of the uh, subscriber or the viewer who uh, recommended that I try this, I will put this up here now. Did I find it? You know, I don't know yet because I haven't edited it, but uh, final bite. Hmm. All right, before I give it a rating, I wanted to show you the other half. This gives you a better look at the uh, cheese right there, the Gruyere cheese. And that actually is a little bit more appealing right there, uh, the cross section of this side. But that is a huge uh, sandwich. And like I said, uh, this could have potential to be up in that 90, 95 range. Uh, but I think a couple other little tweaks to this and we can get you there. But uh, we're going to give it a rating now and we'll see where it lands. So uh, on a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of I'm going to give the holiday I believe it's holiday if not I apologize but this is the turkey cranberry sub or the cranberry turkey sub from Publix a rating of 80 six i'm gonna give it an 86 like i said it should be in that 90 barrier i don't think i've ever reviewed a sub from publix that did not fall in that 90 barrier and like i said this has potential so uh there you go another review in the books please like comment share and subscribe also please do not forget to check me out on instagram and twitter that is social media getting the word of my channel out to the masses all right in closing have you tried this do you agree with me that a holiday sandwich deserves some type of stuffing and maybe a little gravy not gonna lie maybe a little gravy All right, bonus footage. Uh, let me know in the comments below also, what is your go-to spot for a uh, holiday sub or sandwich? I know I did the Wawa Gobbler, I believe, some years back. It's been a while. Uh, maybe I will have to revisit that, but I know that Wawa makes a mean uh, turkey holiday sandwich. I definitely know they have gravy, and I definitely know they have stuffing, so might have to revisit that uh, this upcoming holiday season. So let me know in the comments below, where is your favorite place to get a holiday-inspired sandwich? Let me know.